Hello and welcome back to Melissa Motivation, your weekly dose of brandtastic inspiration and real world application to lead on the next level. So I'm gonna step on some toes, including my own, with this week's motivation. I struggle with boundaries. I don't know if anyone else can relate, but I want to do so much. And the more I do, the more it seems is thrust on my calendar. And without creating boundaries, I am overwhelmed, overextended, and most importantly, I'm frustrated. And that frustration can turn into bitterness if you're not careful. So I know many women struggle with this in particular because they share it with us through our Brand Leadership Institute. And so what I want to say is you're not alone. We all have struggled with how do we make the most of our time. And productivity is so important to being able to succeed, but also have significance and make sure that we're spending the time with the things that matter most. So my admonishment to you this week in getting real is stepping back and saying, if I'm in this state of frenzy, if I'm feeling overwhelmed, stretched and out of control with my schedule, what do I need to do differently? Here are a few things. Number one, step back and reset your calendar. I want you to look at what's on your calendar as it is today. So many of us fill our time with meetings, with free time, that may include being on social media or watching television. Um, we do not put on our calendars what is priority. We think it's just gonna happen, right? Uh, oh, I'm gonna work out, but is it on your calendar? I'm gonna spend time with the kids, but is it on your calendar, right? Because we manage our time by our calendar. And if we don't manage our time, we are going to miss out on monumental opportunities to be with those that we love or to do things that are truly gonna make a major impact. So I want you to step back, look at your calendar. If you don't have your top three priorities on them, if they're personal and professional, I want you to plot those times on your calendar. Number two, I want you to look at your calendar and say, where do I have some wiggle room? Meaning, do I have transition time blocked on my calendar so that when life doesn't happen as I plan, I still am able to juggle it and move and modify as needed. And finally, I want you to do what your calendar says, which means if it's time to leave work, get up and move. A lot of times transitioning requires a shifting space in places. So stepping out of your zone, whatever that work zone, that space that you're physically in will help you begin to make that transition. And finally, Hold yourself accountable by sharing it with others. People don't know your priorities unless you tell them. So make sure to share it with your loved ones, with your colleagues, with your team. Make sure that they help hold you accountable and they understand what matters most to you. So each week, I'm here with you in social, but I want to see you in your inbox. So come on over to velvetsuite.com and join and subscribe to get your weekly dose of Melissa motivation. As I always say, there are billions of brands in this world, but there's only one leader brand like you. You've got this. Now, make it happen.